Hello there, my name is Charles and I'm a storyteller guide with Market Tours here in Edinburgh. Today you find me standing outside number 17 Heriot Road, the childhood home of Robert Louis Stevenson, the world famous Scottish author. You'll be aware of course of many of his classic timeless novels like Treasure Island, Kidnapped and of course Dr Jekyll and Mr Hyde, but he wrote poetry too. He arrived here as a six-year-old with his mother and father and a handful of servants. And back then, the young Robert Louis Stevenson used to look out these very windows, particularly during the dark winter evenings. He was looking out for one man in particular, a man called Leary the Lamplighter. Leary's job was to light the gas lamps of Edinburgh's Victorian era, and that childhood memory stayed with him into adult life when later on he wrote a charming poem about this whole experience as a child back then. It runs like this. My tea is nearly ready and the sun has left the sky. It's time to take the window and see Leary going by. For every night at tea time and before you take your seat, with lantern and with ladder he comes posting up the street. For we are very lucky with a lamp before the door and Leary stops to light it as he does with many more and all oh, before you hurry by with ladder and with light will Leary see a little child and nod to him tonight. It's a difficult childhood for the young Robert Louis Stevenson. He's an only child, he suffered dreadfully from illness, his schooling was frequently interrupted, he didn't get much opportunity to speak to or play with other children of his age. He was lonely but he knew by standing here each night at the window, he could look out onto the street and see a familiar figure who knew him, who recognised him and waved back at him through the darkness. 